Tuesday and welcome to Madeline's Life Management. Today we're going to be talking about stress management. off, it's really important to have a wind down routine. If you have a stressful job or one that requires a lot of energy, coming home and having a wind down routine is really nice because it, it allows your mind to just detox and let everything go, turn all electronics off, take a calming bath, listen to calming music, uh, put some lavender in the oil diffuser you know, pet a cat, read a book, drink some tea. It's also important to come home to an organized, clean space. The irony of me <laughs> saying this, sitting in front of boxes for moving, it's so wonderful when you come home and everything's picked up and the dishes are put away and you just feel so relaxed and home and like you can enjoy yourself and you can pull out a book and you can pull out a cup of tea, you can go to the gym, you can exercise, you can get some endorphins and you don't have to stress about piles and piles of laundry you still need to do. When you come home, there's not added stress. Instead, you're in a calming environment. Visually, you see that your life is organized and put together and that really help, helps mentally. Also feel free to create a calming environment. Have a little nook where you do have some, a lavender candle or some essential oil over there and you know, have fish are very calming, plants are very calming, you know, have calming music, have a coloring book. Uh, coloring is very calming as well. And so have these calming activities all in a little nook and it can be like your stressed out nook and um, the people you live with can know that if you're in that nook, leave you be. One that I love is simply writing things down. Then you don't have the pressure of keeping it all in your head. You know, you have the list, you have a list of things to do, you have, you know, if you have a little thought that you're stressed out about keeping in your head, just write it down. And also, I love having a priority list. So if I have something booked and someone else calls me and there's something else that day, you know, if that thing is on top of my priority list, it's easy, I can say, okay, um, I already have this booked, so I can't do that. Or you can say, you know, work is um, above, you know, this on my priority list, so I'm gonna have to choose that. And, and so it just makes life easier, it makes it simpler, it's very straightforward. Am I getting enough sleep, am I this, am I that? And then um, kind of, you know, look at your priority list and whittle your schedule down if all you need is just 30 minutes to yourself or an hour to yourself and, and find that time. These are two things that I read about and they say that they instantly calm your entire body and those things are stretching and taking deep breaths. <sighs> or you can stretch and take deep breaths. That's, <laughs> that's not a stretch. <laughs> Along with writing things down, keep a calendar and a planner where you can have those day-to-day -day activities so that you know what's coming up. You can look at the weeks ahead and plan your time wisely. I love planners. I love calendars. I love being organized and knowing what's coming up. I don't like, you know, too many surprises unless they're like great surprises like a present. <laughs> but I don't like surprise things to do. Even if it's something fun, I'm like, what? <laughs> Take care of yourself, eat healthy, get enough sleep, exercise, get those endorphins, drink water, reach out for support. You know, there's so many people in your life that love you, find a community, get support, get help, and find a group of humans that you love and can relate to. So this is a tip that I use myself that is wonderful and it just allows you to enjoy your day. And that is if you have something on your to-do list that you're stressed about it, get it over with as soon as possible. So like this morning I had to get my oil changed and I was really worried about it because my dad normally just changes my oil. So I had to like look up a little place that I could go to and all that fun stuff and it was raining, but I got up this morning, I got ready, I Actually, I don't think I got ready. <laughs> I just wore what I was wearing because it was appropriate to um, this place called Nebraska, 
I don't know what it's called, but they were great! And I went, and it was wonderful, and fast, and easy, and I got home, and I just felt so good and ready for the rest of my day, because I had tons of other things scheduled later, and it just took this weight off of my shoulders, it took the stress off of my back, and so I could enjoy the rest of my day and look forward to things that I had without this, you know, little thing in the back of my head that's like, you still have to do this, you still have to do this. But on that note, <laughs> thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next Tuesday.